Action. Hello, uh, we're here today with one of the participants, and let's hear what's her name. My name is Genesis, but um, a lot of people call me Gigi. Okay, Gigi, uh, what do you know about us? I know that you guys are very professional, what you guys do. Um, you guys are very fun to work with. What do we do, like our pageants, uh, calendars? What, what? Uh, do you guys do um, like the International Bikini Pageant, which I was so happy to attend. It was really, really fun. Um, you guys also do... Can you talk about the, the your experience at the pageant? It was hectic. My favorite part was um, <laughs> the, <laughs> the nervousness around the whole entire room. But that made the environment. Did, did you get any confidence for the next one? Maybe if you'll do ever the next one? Definitely. Now that I know the people that I'm working with and how fast and everything's moving around, I, I definitely have more confidence than before. Was it fun if, what, that you brought some uh, friends with you? But that, did it help? Oh, that, that was the best part. It was a little more nerve wracking because they're my friends. But that was the best part, knowing that I can invite them as well. Okay. Was uh, what was the most difficult part of the pageant? Um, the competition, you start to really realize that there's a lot of beautiful girls in the same room, but it, they were so loving, so. Are they friendly? Did it, was it like a, a lot of fighting or it was a, a sportsmanship? Very much of a sportman team. <laughs> okay, did you make any friends? Yes, I actually talked to two of them still today, so that's pretty cool. Okay, uh, would you ever consider to participate in our next pageant? Yeah. Heck yeah, uh, I think so you guys should participate the next So you, you're coming uh, the February 16th uh, at the uh, Calendar Girl uh, pageant? You're going to rep yes. represent the Ebony Girl calendar? Yes, I would love to represent it. I'll be honored. Okay, uh, let's talk about like what are the problems that we faced. O like, did you have any healthy amount of skepticism when we uh, invite you to the pageant? And how do you do that overcome? Maybe? It was... Um, it's different when you're working with different photographers and different people you don't know about because you hear like this world is really crazy so you, you hear a lot of different things but you have to so how do you go about choosing who is the right one to work and who is not research definitely research of their work and you have this well everyone here has a lot of them so that's pretty good so what where do you do your, your research your google model mayhem like well, what well model mayhem Facebook. was where i personally found this um these beautiful people to collaborate with and then Facebook as well Google as well right. so definitely what do you look particularly when you decide with some people to work and with some people not to work what what are the key hot po points that uh, you consider well the most key points to me is um, their work what do they really focus on um, whether it's um, nudity bikini and it's, it's better to be diverse because if they're more open to different things it it's better for you to open yourself to different skills that you're willing to bring out. So, uh, Do you think uh, the Ebony Girl calendar is something that uh, you would like to be in? Yes, I've never ever been a part of a calendar before. So, yes, that's definitely something I would love to be a part of. How, how do you feel about the photo shoot today? Did you do you like your makeup? Do you like your hair? Yes. Do you like the, 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 the crew? I'm very much satisfied. Everybody here is friendly and supportive and we're all good vibes. It's, it's great. I love uh, it. Any advice for the uh, girls who would like to participate in those uh, pageants? Uh, what to do? Take a risk. Life is about taking risk, and if you don't, then what's the point of living sometimes? So I advise them to take a risk and be confident yeah, in who you are. Yes, be, be very confident in who you are and do your research at the same time, and I think everything should be falling into place. What are your inspirations? Why you decide to be a model? Why do you decide to? Why are you doing this? Well, when I was young, a lot of people were would tell me to do modeling. It was never really my thing, but as I got older, I started to really be more loving to myself. I didn't love myself as much, and um, I was very self-conscious of my eyes, and because they were so big, I used to get picked on for a lot of reasons. But definitely, I, I learned to love myself. So that's what inspired me. Thank you for your time. Thank you. Got it.